Hello, everyone. We are back to back in Estonia today. Um, of, this show was pre recorded, right? So uh, it was pre recorded on Sunday and it's going to air on Thursday. So um, we are still working on the helium research. Uh, currently, we have five research, uh, no, six research chambers with 200 helium each. That is 1200 uh, bytes per, uh, per minute uh, sh going strong. That said, I stream every day and I only play on live stream. So if you guys want to get notified when I start streaming, please subscribe and hit that bell icon. The bell icon there is what gives you those notifications 100%. The subscription does not. However, by subscribing, you're helping me because I don't get paid by YouTube until I have a thousand subscribers. We also have a Discord. Um, if you know what it is, if you like to use it, link to the Discord is there um, uh, on my uh, video description and on my YouTube channel. Uh, the game has loaded. Let's get into the game. All right, I see it switch on on uh, YouTube. That is uh, precarious. Okay, we wanted to expand this here a little bit. So that we can make more. And here the, the finish sound is okay. The finish sound is okay. Right? Because we are creating the gas out of thin air. to fix that. It's terrain 3.0. I don't know what to tell you. Okay, so it does seem to fill up even with the helium. Sticky feet. I can't believe this nonsense. I can't believe this nonsense. Terrain 3.0. Exactly that. So maybe what we need to do is we need to get more research chambers there. I will see what I can do. I'm getting a little tired. Well, this is as much as this thing has, I think. Yep, that's it. Donskis on that thing. Here the finishing sound is okay. The camera. I, I don't even understand how how system error can. I mean, I guess they're making money, right? But how can you have this game? I will get stuck with stuff if I am not careful. So we could make more research chambers because it looks like we are getting we're getting the helium fast enough. Right? It looks like we are getting the helium fast enough. Let me see. These ones are full with helium. So helium is the way to go. We need more research chambers. That's what I'm saying. Uh, let's do that then, right? Let's do that then. More research chambers? I, I like that. That's good. So eventually these will fill up. Sticky feet. Oh, let me just check if everything is looking good. Okay. So we need uh, these platforms. How many should I make? Um, you know what? Let's make another six. Why not? Let's go to uh, silver get more soil. So long. If I click the moon, I'm going to be upset. Thankfully, we have infinite hydrogen. Okay. 
Thankfully, we have infinite hydrogen. Okay. So I will expand the, re the research chambers to four each. Maybe this will be too much, but let's see. Infinite hydrogen. I'm almost used up here. All right, uh, give me this. How many do we need to make? Six? My goodness. Okay, so hold on. One thing. First things first. Uh, that goes here. The intern did fill this up. That's good. That's good. That's good. Is this still working? Yeah. So I think it's just when there's two players in the game, it has issues. Uh, let's move this here a little bit so that we give us some room. What is this? This is an atmospheric condenser. We don't need this at the moment. We do need this. We do need this. We don't need this. And we need some research chambers. So I'm just going to dupe each one six times. One, two, three, four, five, actually seven, six, because one needs to stay here as, as the, so this is seven, okay, so you come later. Sorry, getting a little tired. Oh, did you see the camera jump? Why? Why does it do that? I don't understand. So there should be seven. One of them goes here. And then where is my thing? Yep, here. Beautiful. One, two, three. Four, five, and six. Good, and now we need to do the exact same thing with the research chamber. Is there more research chambers? Yeah, there is. There is a couple more. Good. I will put one of these in here just in case. Did you guys see that? The animation was flawed. So we're still getting 11,000, but uh, of course the chambers are emptying out. That's the problem, right? We need sort of something that we work on automation and then it will run forever and ever. That's what we need to do. Four. Five. Yeah, unfortunately, they're all running out now. All right, let's just check that this is seven here. Uh, four. Yep. Good. So we see that the helium is backing up. That is good because power is something that we have control over, right? Um, and that's easy to achieve for us.
Okay. Let's go. Uh, check this out. Atrox. Right next to us. We're getting past noon. Just to be there. I didn't bring soil, but uh, that's okay. I think we have enough to do with this. Yeah, that is what I anticipated. The auto arm will be able to feed this one. I don't know, maybe I should lock them. It's good that the helium is faster. I was deeply concerned about that. I was thinking that, you know, we can't produce enough helium for one research chamber. And now the helium feeds uh, four of them. It, it may run out, but that's okay. At least we are having something scalable here. Good. Yeah, this is this is going swimmingly, to be honest. This is going really well. The problem with that is it needs power, right? But power is something that we can generate.
Good. Let's see how the um, atmospheric condensers are keeping up now. There seems to be excess, but it has to serve four of them. Right, so there is a little bit more to this now. We need to do another power calculation. So each one of those sets is eight, nine. So let's break out the calculator. So we have nine, uh, you know what? I still have this thing on me. Okay, let's go up here. Technically, I should bring a battery, right? That's also a good screenshot, I feel. So, we have nine atmospheric conden condensers. Nine times 20 is that, 180. And then this is eight, nine. Uh, nine times three is 27 plus 180 is 207. 207 divided by four, divided by 12. We need 4.3 of those um, storage things. So we are on power. We, we, we have uh, excess power. And this seems to be going really well. Well, there's an empty one there. I'm getting sticky feet on this thing. Sticky feet on this thing. So they seem to be now being able to keep up. But you know, in my in my opinion, it is okay if you occasionally have empty one. Now, how much how many bytes do we get? We get uh, there is four, eight, twelve. We get twelve times two hundred. Two thousand four hundred bytes. So we just keep doing that and we should be in good shape. And this cannot break, like the other stuff. I mean, we assume. But the, the resources are being generated out of thin air, so it's fine. Yeah, I see how they are being refilled. So this was 12 times 200, 2400 24, bytes per minute. So I think before we continue, uh, we should make more power. Let's let's go and do that. But because we took a lot of power on silver, so this is making 400, 2,400 bytes until the cows come home. The other thing that we have on the, it's 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 you know supplementing, but we need more of those things. Uh, we need 10 more of those things to be able to really crank it. I think this one. So I will refuel here just in case. I think we just refueled. <clears throat> And my thing, refueled too. Good.
Okay, so now we need we have a couple of those. Uh, we need to dupe RTGs basically. This is all empty, right? That's that's the problem with uh, doing this. I hear the, the thing going. We have three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Because I borrowed this one. But then we take it over here. Put it right here. Feed the snail. Oh, okay, hold on. Good, then uh, one goes back on here. So now we have 7,800 bytes going. We just need to make more automation, right? Uh, feeding the research items, I think it's not as much of an investment as, um, as making automation, because the automation will keep giving you bytes forever and ever. Oh, I don't have the, the jetpack active. Oh, goodness. This game. Might as well use some of these. While we are doing stuff. And let's get this guy here. I'm just making some power here. Because we uh, took some power.
So I think that my insight now is that the research item form that we have uh, on in front of us. Oh, I, I don't have the thing active. Oh, I have an idea. Can I do this? Noise. That was awesome. So we restored four. I'll put those here so that the intern can make more. But my insight is that this item farm here is labor intensive. It works, but it's labor intensive. It is better to set up automation and do stuff with automation like we do over here because the automation will run forever, you know? And we get the benefit from the automation forever and ever. Let me see here, uh, how is the hydrogen looking? Uh, 14, yeah, I can use a repo. Can you use a repo? Is this still hydrogen? Okay, that's done. Turn this off. Yeah, because this thing runs forever, right? And it gives, the, the only problem is that there's bugs in the game. When, when I don't have a second player on, uh, th this is fine, right? When I don't have a second player on, this is fine. I think my wife wants me to go uh, hiking with her soon, so I have to wrap this up. Okay, this is just coming back. So we're making now 8,000 bytes per minute, right? So I think the um, this is too complicated to maintain, right? And it breaks. It's, the game has bugs, it breaks, and stuff like that. It works in principle, but the atmospheric condensers is the way to do this, right? So we are going to continue working on that, on the atmospheric condensers. That seems to be a good recipe. The only thing that we need to do is uh, have power, right? And and then we are in good shape. What is this? This is all trade platforms. Good. Is a research chamber. I think I have a research chamber here. Yeah. And there's the auto arm. So we're going to expand that the the helium because I think the helium is more robust is more robust of a solution. This is very labor intensive here. I mean, once it's set up, right, labor is less labor. You just need to do these things, um, but they run out and then you need to dupe them again. So it's, it's a lot of labor, right? While the helium uh, keeps going, right? While the helium keeps going. I actually want to visit the helium real quick, just to see, we spent some time here just to see how it looks. Do we have excess? Do we get empty ones? Um, what's the timing? Because before we had access, right? There, there was four helium on, on the end of each platform. So we set up uh, additional research chambers. So now I want to see, uh, do we have helium excess? Do we have empty research chambers? Which one is it? That is the interesting part for me. Because some time has passed where the systems can sort of get into a run state. And I want to know how the run state look like, looks like. Uh, are we going to get helium or are we going to have empty research chambers? We have empty research chambers. So that means that three is enough. 
three is enough. Let's try that. We can reuse these for something else. Right, and I will just leave them like so. There's two, two empty ones here. So empty research chambers basically means that that we okay, that's clearly in there, but we are too fast to research. And we can, in principle, set up another one here. But because we already have the, the research chambers ready. Yep. How was this one locked? So three research chambers will be enough. I wonder if there's bugs too with this, that the automation doesn't properly work. And technically this one can be in the center. The autodarm can reach both of them, so it doesn't really matter. I want to change all the others to so this. Camera and garbage. And this seems to be all working. None of them stopped. I wonder if there's bugs with this. Yeah, I mean, four was too many. That is our learning. A two was too little, four was too many. That is what I take from this. So I'm a little bit concerned that they all are like running out now. Why is this so difficult? The simplest thing, right? You just want to go on top of the stage. The game makes it so hard. I still, I still don't have it. I still don't have it. I need to take a, a screenshot of that too. We don't have a power problem. One hundred percent. We don't have a power problem. This is just: can they make enough helium? And maybe there is a bug there too. Who knows? That is what I'm saying. So tomorrow we're going to expand this. We need definitely more power. Okay. I'm going to save and quit now because we need to go and do some stuff. All right, everyone. Uh, that was that was interesting, right? We at least we know that uh, two research chambers, the helium was piling up on the platform. Uh, the four research chambers, the chambers were empty. So maybe three is sort of like a sweet spot where we are going to get continuous uh, byte generation, right? And again, the idea is that we need to crank it up to like something like 20,000, 40,000, something like this, right? to really uh, get the 1 billion bytes um, in a month. And I also am thinking that the strategy of, of putting research items into research chambers, the, the Atrox research items, while it does work, it is it needs continuous attention. Um, if you use automation, what you're doing is you're basically setting up more and more and more automation and the, the existing automation is doing stuff for you while you're setting up more automation. So that seems to scale, right? While putting research items into research chambers, 
um, they get used up and you need to make more research items, right? So you sort of in a constant loop filling the chambers, right? Well, if the automation, the existing automation keeps making bytes and the new automation adds bytes and that is what we need. Um, that said, I stream every day and I only play on live stream. So if you guys want to get notified when I start streaming, please subscribe and hit that bell icon. The bell icon is what gives you those notifications 100%. The subscription does not. However, subscribing, you're helping me because I don't get paid by YouTube until I have a thousand subscribers. We also have a Discord. Uh, if you know what it is and like to use it, uh, link on this website. Uh, in the video description and on my YouTube channel. That's it for today. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.